With a path towards potential treatment for his mental health issues now in place, the lingering effects of Michael's drug addiction still remained, as the family moved to Florida in an effort to reset their lives. But several failed attempts at drug rehab left Deborah at a crossroads. So sometimes the smallest thing, even something small, can start a cascade that literally triggers so many things along the way. And we don't think about that until we're in the event itself and we don't know how to get out. He did say once that he was going to kill himself. And that's something he would have never said. But this was at a point that he was so lost and pretty much begging me not to leave him. If you leave me, I'm going to kill myself. Now, with that being said, that was like, and this may not go over very well, and I'm going to say it, but I left anyway because I'm not responsible for him. I'm not. And I had to learn that. And there, you know, we can't take responsibility for someone else's choices. And sadly, too many people think that they have to. And I think in that moment, you know, we also look at murder suicides in our data. And I'm telling you that sometimes when people stay, we can have an additional issue. So there is no way in the world I would ever blame anyone for leaving. And you can only do so much. And the other person has to step up and get the help. You can't make them get help.